Well, hi everybody, I'm Bill Cullerton, president of Bagley Baits, and I'm here at the ICAST show in Las Vegas with the folks from Tackle Warehouse. Happy to be with these guys. I'd like to show you some of our new Bagley baits. You know, Bagley is 100% balsa wood throughout, so there's no plastic in the line at all. All the Bagley baits are 100% wood, and uh, we tank test every single bait before it hits the box. Uh, one of the new lures we have this year is our Bangalore in a smaller size, the number three size. So fishing for smallmouth or for largemouth bass in certain conditions when they're feeding on smaller fish, the Bangalore three size should be a good bait for you. We're going to do it in the spin tail where the spinner works uh, in the back. So it's designed to fish on the surface. So you rip it, let the spinner fuss the water up, let it set and repeat that two or three times and you, you should entice a big bass to come up and hit. We also do it without the spinner in the regular three size Bangalore without the spinner. So both of those baits hopefully will be great additions to your tackle box this year. Uh, other things I'd like to show you, we spent a long time developing a brand new color to Bagley called the Bluegill. Uh, we're going to put this throughout the line, so this would be in the Bangalores. This is a balsa bee right here, so all the balsa bees, diving bees, killer bees, honeybees, uh, our new musky baits, everything's going to have this new pattern. And if you notice, uh, as a closer look to this, we took a lot of time working on the scales because a, a bluegill is a heavily scaled fish. So scales are very important. And if you hold that fish up in the sun, an actual bluegill, you'll notice that it has all these iridescent, beautiful blues and purples and yellows. So we were able to capture that as best we can. You, you can never beat God at color, but we're coming pretty close with this new bluegill color right here. Uh, another improvement in our colors I'd like to point out to you is our new Tennessee Shad color. Uh, we looked at the Tennessee Shad that we had in our own line and it was just too silver, just too shaddy and not a Tennessee Shad. So we cataloged back and looked through books and found old lures that had the actual color of a Tennessee Shad and we actually looked at the Shad got the fish, an actual Tennessee shad, and we noticed again it was a heavily scaled bait fish, but it has a very green tinge to it, and the difference between a gizzard shad and a Tennessee shad really comes in the color, and you need that green tinge in there, and so we believe we captured that in the new Tennessee shad. Again, that'll be in all new Bagley baits coming out in the fall.